New at five, a local man is accused of raping a woman who he met on Facebook. Police say the victim has mental disabilities and it's not the first time the suspect has done something like this. Ross Gadotti takes a look at the charges he's facing tonight. Wearing a protective suit because investigators took the clothes he was wearing into evidence, Parker Foster Jr. walked out of the Greensburg police station accused of raping a mentally challenged woman. The two meeting via social media. Uh, they had become friends on Facebook. They made arrangements to meet at the Dollar General store. Uh, he was going to take her to McDonald's to get something to eat. So apparently at McDonald's he made some inappropriate comments. Officials say the victim told Foster that she had a boyfriend and asked to be taken back to her Greensburg apartment. She made clear that she didn't want him to come in. But investigators say Foster, who's 54 years old, went in anyway, then raped the woman. Takes her phone off of her and, and sets it away from her so, so she's unable to, to call for help or call 911. Foster only leaving the apartment when the victim started to cry and scream. It definitely seems to be a, a history of him acting like this. In fact, in January of 2016, Foster was arrested for rape of a mentally challenged woman. Those charges were dropped over evidence issues. Then in June, also of 2016, he was charged with two counts of indecent assault, but those were lowered to simple assault and he was given probation. Parker Foster Jr. now faces 14 new charges, many of them felonies, to include rape of a mentally disabled person. Parker Foster right now heading back to the Westmoreland County Jail. He's held without bond. The judge citing the fact that he was on probation from his 2016 simple assault charges. In Greensburg, Ross Gadotti, KDKA News.